everyone wavy wavy <laughs> hope you're all okay um i just thought i would put the camera out the window while i'm chatting to you it's been snowing for about an hour i didn't realize we were expecting snow today but i just happened to look up and i'm like oh okay <laughs> goodbye <laughs> i've had enough of you now thank you um excuse me i got a cup of coffee here um, just basically coming on a quick little chat to say that I am afraid I haven't as yet I still haven't got any of my little um, giveaway prizes sent out to anybody um, I have started gathering bits and bobs but I still haven't I, I know I haven't said a date when I was I just said after Christmas <laughs> <laughs> did i say which christmas <laughs> um uh, and i'm referring to the hidden giveaway that i had i think it was back in november um yeah you you all anybody that joined in that you'll know what i'm talking about so but as yet i have you but you will be getting something sometime <laughs> i promise but I just don't know. I'll let you know when I've sent things. Anyway, I don't know if I'll be able to show you this or not. Just a minute. But I had this. I don't know if this is going to work. I had this lovely Christmas card come yesterday from my lovely friend across the pond, Dawn, from Dawn's crafty room you can't really see it that well beautiful card thank you ever so much dawn i don't think she comes on youtube now but um and it was posted what is it today it's the 23rd of so the 22nd of january and it was posted on the 1st of december i mean it came in absolute pristine condition the envelope did as though she just hand posted it maybe she did maybe she snuck across thought huh won't rely on the post i'll <laughs> no i'll not be stupid um yeah so uh, it's you know there's a couple of things this week that have taken weeks and weeks to come but at least they're getting here it's what a blooming state everywhere's getting in a eh, with the postal system and everything oh, i don't know but things can only get better can't they um, I'm waiting for Mr. Doodle to come home. Bless him. He's um, he's well. He he he. His weekend at the moment is usually Friday and Saturday, but he had chance to go into work yesterday, so he did because it's um, extra money he can earn, like two days' money on this particular job that there was on. So he said, "Oh, I'll go in." But I said, oh, you're mad. <laughs> um, but bless him, he's... Uh, I don't think I mentioned it, but a couple of weeks ago, he's, he's a truck driver. For anybody that doesn't know, he's a lorry driver. And he's he had trouble with his left knee. His leg, left leg started hurting him anyway. It was basically his knee. So a couple of weeks ago... Oh, and I don't think I've told you. A couple of weeks ago on the, the Sundays, he rang me before he was, because he works on a Sunday, he rang me before he was going to come home. And he says, I'm, I'm going up the hospital to the walk-in centre because my knee's really bad. And so off he went. Anyway, cutting a long story short, he had x-rays and that. And they said that he's got arthritis in his knee and he actually took a, um, a photograph of the x-ray that the doctor showed him and the doctor just said oh take paracetamol so that was that he's on all sorts of medication for other things as well um so that was that and his knees still been hurted him i mean he's severely overweight which obviously doesn't help but he has been trying this past couple of weeks <laughs> to lose a bit of weight but it's a it's a never-ending battle for anybody that's obese it's been there done that thankfully i'm not obese now i'm in what they class as normal weight range <laughs> um 
But yeah, so he's been struggling on at work. And then yesterday, he's had two good days this week. He said, it's the best two days I've had. Uh, and some of his other medications have been juggled around and that for other things. He said, best two days I've had. Anyway, yesterday, bless him. I felt so sorry for him. He came home. I said, oh dear. He says, oh, I've, I've hurt my other knee. So, because when you've, when you've got something wrong with you one side, the, your other side compensates, doesn't it? I mean, you know, I've had all that with my, when I've had back problems over the years and, um, oh dear, I mean, his mother was definitely right when she used to say there's no joy in getting older. <laughs> um, yeah, so um, so he'd, he'd hurt his knee and he, he sat last night, I kept getting him ice um to put on his other knee <laughs> and anyway this morning I went into him I says you all right he says well he says I'm actually thinking about going up to the walking centre at the hospital he said the woman at work wants because he's supposed to be at work tomorrow the woman at work wanted to know today you know what to do about tomorrow's work so I said, well, if you're thinking about it, he says, oh, I don't know whether to go up or whether to just rest it. And I said, well, you know, if you're thinking about it, you may as well just go. So obviously I can't go with him. I mean, uh, um, they wouldn't let me in anyway and I'm useless because I don't drive. So, uh, um, yeah, so he's gone up and he's he's been up there a couple of hours and he just said that he's just been in to see the doctor and now he's waiting for an x-ray. So then... He'll have to go back and see the doctor again. and So I don't know what will become of that one, but he's really ready to retire, but he's got a few more years yet. And you can't just afford to retire. Well, we can't. <laughs> so I don't know. Anyway, I just thought I would share that little bit with you in case I'm sounding doom and gloomish in my upcoming videos. Well, you, you'll all still be, those that are following will still be watching the 31 days of easy peasy painty papers. But I have started Febra Jelly. Yes, hashtag Febra Jelly. I'm just calling it Febra Jelly because I don't know how many days I will be doing it for. I've done five days already, so... For those of you that have been really super excited about the painty videos, I've got those. Um, and yesterday's, days five, was I was really pleased because the previous day I hadn't been feeling it. Well, you'll see that in <laughs> those videos, but it's all good fun. It's all good fun. Um, and it's, you know, with all that's going on, there's other things going on with people in the family and that and uh, um, it's just keeping my mind occupied and we all need that don't we so I do hope this isn't coming across as a doom and gloom because I don't really want it to oh look at it snowing now I absolutely love love watching it snow but I can't wait for Mr Doodle to come home now and then I hope he can have a week off of work well he's got next Thursday and he's off next Thursday and Friday anyway because the fence there well, I can't point now <laughs> you won't be able to see my finger but that fence that I showed you um, the man's hopefully <laughs> coming to do it next the end of next week so quite whether he'll work in snow or rain or whatever I don't know but we shall see. But anyway, Mr Doodles put those couple of days off. So I really hope that he can, you know, have the whole week off. So he can get it rested up and sorted out. And because it's horrible watching somebody struggle. And he's it's been giving him like toothache in it at night time. And oh, it's, it, it's awful. But you just have to look after each other, don't you? It's actually quite mesmerising watching the snow fall. And at least it sort of brightens the day up. 
Oh, it looks as though it's going to be set in for the day. I really wasn't expecting it. We won't be going and building snowmen. I don't know whether it's actually snowing in town where Mr Doodle's at the hospital. He didn't say anything. But probably hasn't noticed. Right, my lovely peoples. I, um, I seem to think there was something else I was going to say, but it's just a bit of a, a random video that I just thought about. Uh, I was going to tell you about that card. No, I can't really remember. I remember when I've pressed the stop recording button, won't I? So I might go in my little craft room now and see if I can do a bit more painting. But yes, um, oh, just before I go, I mean, thank you ever so much, everyone, again, for all your lovely comments on my, vid my videos in general. But um, they've mainly been the painty, Easy Peasy Painty Paper series at the moment for January. Uh, um, I, I'm so thrilled that there's so many of you. And if I start to name names, I will forget people and then <laughs> I'll be I'll be a bit. Well, it's not nice to forget people, but you all know who you are that are following both people on on that do videos and people that don't do videos. I'm getting such a lot of comments, lovely comments saying that you're enjoying it. And that may, it makes me really happy that, you know, you're following in and uh, um, because we do lack confidence in our own things and, and doing videos, you know, to start with. I thought, well, are people going to? They'll probably be bored less. <laughs> um, but this, you know, you're enjoying it and that makes me happy. And, you know, it's all about trying to lift people up, isn't it? And lifting each other up. And, wow, look at it snowing now. It's lovely. <laughs> um, so, yeah, I mean, the, the people that have done videos and have put pictures up on, instagram because there's people following on instagram as well uh, you're getting some absolutely amazing results and i have just got to say and i, I don't want to uh, um just follow the hashtag uh, um oh, i've forgotten what it was i'll put it in the thing 31 days of 31 31 d e p p p I haven't got my piece of paper because I didn't intend talking about that, I don't think. Um, but if you look at that, you'll see all the other people's. Lorna Callahan. oh my goodness, I was absolutely mesmerised watching all your beautiful painty papers that you, you'd done the other night and the other ladies that I've put videos up. You're doing some absolutely, you're getting some absolutely amazing effects results that they're brilliant all of you but uh, Lorna in particular wow <laughs> and those I've I've got to get some of those paints I need a trip to B&M's to get some of those paints no I don't need any more paints I need to use my paints but those paints it just goes to show that you really don't need expensive paints because Lorna's been getting hers from I think she got a great big box full of was it 20 or 24 smallish tubes but then they were like 5.99 or something and then she bought bigger tubes as well for I think they were I don't know two pounds or something three for five pounds something like that and she's really pleased with them and they look amazing they really that video that he did the other night i was like wow <laughs> um but i don't want to disclude the other ladies because you're all you're all absolutely brilliant and uh, you know it's just so lovely to see everybody's take on the the painty things and what you're using and what you're improvising with because obviously you're not all going to have exactly the same things that I've got um I think I just heard a little jingle so I don't know whether that's Mr Doodle come home because I put my phone on to airplane mode so it's it doesn't cut the video off don't know right on that note i'm going to go because 15 minutes of twaddle but thank you again ever so much everyone take care and i will speak to you soon bye